Yeah, so you moved here 15 years ago. What, what made you, 15 years ago, decide to move to Thailand? Thailand. Well, actually, it was probably 17 years ago. Uh, being long term. No. You've I've got, got, yeah, I've got, I've got, got thing, got, things to do and I've places got, to go. I've got math, I've got the world to see. Yeah, yeah. Say. yeah. Asking what uh, visa are you on, Dean? Okay, so I've just uh, applied for a retirement visa. Oh, you just applied? And you're on retirement visa? Yeah. yeah. How's that? The third person retiring here now, just yeah. in the garden here, well there's four, there's another one. He's going to come on in a minute. So, you're applied for the visa, yeah. how's the process been? Good morning, it's Friday here in Phuket. We're going to do a new section here, we're going to do some Friday shout outs. We have a few regulars coming to the shop lately, some YouTubers, so let's give them a little shout out and see if we can give them a boost, you know help a brother out, that's the kind of guy I am. Just waiting for my flat white and yeah, let's see who turns up. You never know, maybe no one, hopefully a few. Let's see. There's Jay. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, Jay. Good morning. How are you? Fine, thank you. Good, good. <laughs> I'm gonna work. Today I come to maybe a coffee garden. Oh, how are you doing? I'm free. Uh, East where where are you from? I'm from uh, Brazil. <laughs> I'm um, oh, 100 years old. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is time for the first shout out we have here. Where are you in All the way Canada? from Isan. What's your name? Where are you from? Maybelline. Maybe Maybelline? <laughs> Mary Bell. <laughs> Maybell. How are you doing this morning? I'm good. You're looking good, babe. You're Excited. looking fresh. Oh, Excited. yes. And guess what? There could be a big video coming soon. Because this one here is the number one fan of... Justin Bieber. Oh, my God. <laughs> Justin Bieber. Tickets have gone on sale today. And, uh, and Maybell is the going... The website is error now. The website is going down, baby, because Thai girls love Justin Bieber. And yeah, I'm going to have to go to a Justin Bieber concert. And this one wants to sit right at the front. Okay, the first customer of, well, not really, actually. <laughs> Some more behind us, but our regular, Stefan. Introduce yourself, buddy. Well, my name is Stefan from Sweden. Sweden, all the way from Shout Out Sweden. <laughs> Shout Out Sweden. Hey, we're meeting a lot of people from Sweden. Yeah. You guys love a bit of Phuket. Yeah, there's a lot of people coming here. Uh, how long have you been here? Uh, four months. Now. Four months. From Stefan's a regular customer, subscriber. Yeah. And what have you done? You just... Living. You just ditched this Sweden. Yeah. And moved here to... Move. Yeah. I uh, quit my job, sold everything I had and uh, moved here. And uh, planning to stay as long as I can. Retiring here, yeah? yeah? But... Uh, if you don't mind me asking, how old are you? I'm 52. 52, so you're going to have to do something for... Yeah. You know, you've got some money in the bank, but you need to... I mean, business more or something. More income or something. Yeah, an income. Yeah. yeah. You're going to work that out along the way, yeah, right? Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. Now you're taking a bit of downtime. Yeah, exactly. You enjoying yourself? Yeah, I do, I do. Everything is calm and it's... Uh, Take it a little bit easy, go to the beach each day almost. Yeah. A couple of beers then and then. <laughs> yeah, a couple of beers, sunset. Yeah. And you're on retirement visa. Yeah, yes. How's that? It's good. It's good. Yeah. For a year and then I uh, have to get a new one. Yeah. And what you what you ordered? What are you just ordered? <laughs> I ordered a tropical bowl. Oh. Yeah. Something else to stay. Going yeah. healthy today. Yeah, no today. breakfast. Enjoy. Thank and, you. And uh, hot latte. Thank you, <coughs> yeah. Stefan. Hello, Stefan's mum and family and friends. Hello, everybody. Don't worry, Stefan's safe. We're looking <laughs> after him. <laughs> That's good. Someone's happy. How long now? 15 minutes left. 15 minutes. And then you're about to book the ticket. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully, everything goes smooth, babe. <laughs> okay, another Friday shout out. We've got Dean here. Dean, all the way from the UK, just you, outside London. Just outside London. London. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. And how long have you been in Thailand? 
Um, for about a month now, coming up. One month. month. Yeah. You're a newbie, fresh. How are you getting on? You enjoying it? I'm enjoying it very much. It's Good. quite hot. Hot. It's so quite I'm, hot. It's I'm hot. Yes. <laughs> Um, yeah, that's good though, you know, it's not cold, it's not, well, raining, it rains as well, but yeah. Uh, and what, you don't mind me asking, what uh, visa are you on, Dean? Okay, so I've just uh, applied for a retirement visa. Oh, you just applied? Yeah, so I'm hopefully in the next week or, or so I should receive that. Okay, so you're in the process. Yeah. What visa did you come on? Um, the a... normal 30-day tourist visa. Oh, yeah, yeah, see, so you can just turn up on the normal visa and apply when, once you're here, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I was eventually, I was originally going to get one from the UK, but it was just going to take too long yeah. to do that process. So I thought, I did some research and found out that I can actually yeah, do it Yeah, you can just here. do it here, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and it's pretty straightforward, right? Yeah. Yeah. You've had a long love affair with Thailand. You've been married a long time. Yeah, it's uh, 12 years, over 12, 12 years. years. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, okay, so what, uh, here in Thailand, what are you doing? Like, how are you financing your, your stay? Okay, you're, you're so. You're retired? Yep, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm retired. Um, I did sell some property as, right. as, as well. Yeah. So, um, yeah. And, yeah, we're going to do a little shout out here because Dean is also, I've seen you around, I've seen you filming. Dean's doing YouTube. We'll put yeah. a link to your YouTube. Yeah. Let's see if we can get you some subscribers. Some jump on there, give him some comments, like nice comments, guys. That you know, we don't want them. Yeah. No, please, no, <laughs> no thumbs down. Some, uh, yeah, no, well, <laughs> thumbs down. You know, YouTube stopped showing thumbs down. I don't know why. Yeah. Hey, look, anyone can have their opinion, but constructive criticism, I would say, is best. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, Dean? Definitely. And definitely. you've been a regular at the coffee garden, thanks a lot. Thanks for keep coming and thank you. Yeah, yeah. Let's I'm, try I'm, the coffee. I'm, I'm enjoying my coffee. Oh, let, let's as, give a, as let's, always. Let's do a taste test. No, it's always perfect. Anyway, he likes so, it. He yeah. likes the coffee. Yeah, yeah, keeps yeah. coming back. Yes. And you're moving to Hua Hin, I believe. I, I, I'm hoping. Yes. Right, so maybe once so. my stay finishes here, so I booked uh, for three months here, then uh, Hoa Hin. Yeah. yeah. So if you're interested to see how. Dean's journey pans out, retiring here, moving to Hua Hin. Jump on his channel and follow, follow along, eh? Mm. Okay, cool. Please do, please do. Yeah, cheers. Thanks, Thanks Dean. Thanks very much, Richard. <laughs> cheers. Okay, we have another Friday shout out. Uh, you want to introduce yourself, please? Hi, I'm, yeah, my name's Ernest. I'm uh, from Adelaide, Australia, and uh, been here in Phuket for the last uh, four weeks now. Four weeks? Yeah, oh, another newbie. Yes. Uh, subscriber to our channel, customer in our coffee garden. Thanks a lot, Ernest. You... Oh, it's a fantastic garden and we love being here. This is, uh, I think, our fourth time now. Oh, great. Yes. Thanks for <laughs> keep coming back. So, how is your... Are you coming to stay in Thailand long term or what's the plan? What's the... Exciting news. Yes. Yesterday, I put in an application for my reti retirement visa. Yeah. So definitely going to stay here long term. Right. And also found my dream home uh, coconut throw from the sea. Really? Wow, <laughs> that is good news. So, uh, okay. moving in there tomorrow. So that's another, That's you're the third person retiring here now, just yes. in the garden here. Well, there's four, there's another one. He's going to come on in a minute. So, you're applied for the visa. Yes. How's the process been? How is it? Oh, look, I think the agent is going to do most oh, of the hard work, agent. getting an agent to do it. Um, they're charging really reasonable price. Yeah. Um, my girlfriend's doing her ED visa through them, right. so they're at okay. school. Yeah. Um, so the process itself really was hand over some money yeah. and passport, and, and, and they're going to do everything else. Great, great. Yes. Uh, so, okay. You're staying in Phuket? Phuket at the moment, yes. Yeah. 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 So um, we've been, uh, we stayed in uh, Kalim Beach for eight nights. Kalim, right, yeah, that's just. North of Patong. North of Patong. Really beautiful view yeah. of Patong Beach. Really nice view. Wow. And then we went down to Rawai Beach for eight nights. Right. Um, I really like Rawai Beach because it's a lot more local than, than tourists. Right. And uh, for the last eight nights we've been staying in, sorry, seven nights. One more night to go uh, here in Kata Beach. Kata Beach, right. Yes. Okay. So um, where have you found a longer accommodation? Where are you going to stay? Um, in Kalim. In Kalim, you like yes. that area? 
It, it looks nice, um, yeah. but the place is actually yeah. what drew us there. Yeah, I usually say to people, don't tie yourself into a long term, try here, mm. try there, move around a bit, it's a big island. It is, And yes. find the place you like the best. Yes, yeah? exactly, yes. Okay, so uh, what will you be doing here? Because I believe we have another new budding YouTuber, right? <laughs> <laughs> yes, well look, um, my background is uh, I'm a therapist, I'm a hypnotherapist back in oh, right, Australia okay. yeah, yeah. and I'm still seeing clients online okay, yeah. um, because you know thanks to fantastic internet in Phuket yeah. and, and yeah, most good. of Thailand it's, high speed, eh? it's really good yeah. and it's I mean really affordable I've got an unlimited uh, mobile plan um, works out to about 16 Australian dollars a month oh, yeah. and that's you know, we can nothing. get DTAC SIM card Unlimited for one year is 1,700 and something baht. Wow. But after one yes. year, it turns into year, a contract. Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah, so you're still kind of working online, you're not fully retired. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's good. Still that's keep good. myself busy. And uh, and yes, um, I was thinking about starting up a YouTube channel uh, more from a, and I'm thinking from a motivational point of view. So uh, my idea is, is to interview. Uh, YouTubers, interview YouTubers to right. actually see um, what got them started and how are things going for them, and yeah. to find out what got them started, but also since they started, what's what's the experience been like, okay. and um, and is this something that they uh, that they found helpful, good for themselves to do? Right. Um, have they had really interesting experiences? Yes. Um, and um, how they would pursue it. And you actually did one of them with me, right? And we did actually <laughs> one of those yeah, just yeah, recently, yeah. yes. Yeah. So, um, so would you mind, because now one, two, you're the third person in the garden this morning that's retired, would you mind revealing your age? 52. 52, ah, similar, everyone's quite similar. Cause, you know, I'm just asking that because it seems like a lot of people are retiring earlier, which is, I think, awesome. Yes. Well, it's, it's awesome actually that Thailand is offering that opportunity for people at 50. Just at 50. 50 years old, yeah. you can apply for a retirement visa, 800,000 baht you have to have in the bank. Yeah. That's pretty much it, I think. Pretty much, yeah. Okay, well, I'll put a link to your channel. If Thank people you. want to find out some about some YouTubers doing it, they can jump onto your channel, Ernest. The secrets about YouTubers. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, well, now, Donny. Donny's here. Long Donny actually is a long term expat retiree, and I think you was the first customer not even customer because you weren't even open the first free, person to turn up at Mabel's Coffee Garden. Yeah, I got free coffee when and we food first opened. Donny turned up and went, Hey guys, I've been watching you, and he obviously seen that we we're just opening this. So, yeah, long term expat Donny, how long have you been living in Thailand? Come October, 15 years. 15 years. That's good because we've got three newbies in the garden. You're the long term. So, where are you from? You know, what made you retire in Thailand? And yeah, how's the experience been? Well, I'm from America, the USA. The USA, yeah. And my home's actually in Chiang Mai for right, the yeah, last 13 yeah, years. Yeah. But I come to Phuket for clean air every winter. Yeah, away from the smoke. Yeah. So you moved <laughs> here 15 years ago. What what made you? 15 years ago, decided to move to Thailand. Thailand. Well, actually, it was probably 17 years ago. Right. I was 48 then. Yeah. I'm giving my age away. <laughs> uh, we'll get to you. I used to go in the wintertime for detox. Right, yeah. And they have a place in Samui that does that. So I, my first trip there, because it's $10,000 in the US, it was $2,000 to do it here. I said, well, oh, right. I can yeah, do yeah. math. So you used to visit here and I like the place. Yeah, and like the people. Yeah, yeah. Because I had a place in, the, in uh, Central America on an island that's just as beautiful as Phuket, but Thai people and Thai food, you, number yeah. one and number two. I mean, so look, we just touched on your age. So you retired. You retired early. How old was you when you retired? And Fifty moved years old. Fifty years old. That's when you can get a retirement. So, uh, oh, you as soon as you was allowed, yeah. Yep. And how did you finance that life? You know, retirement. Wow. Okay. I know you had a business. I know you had a business, but between you know. robbing banks and being, <laughs> <laughs> well, I had a masonry restoration business in yeah. Columbus, Ohio, in America, and amongst other small businesses. But that was the main. That's how it got me here. And the other thing was property. Yeah? Oh, yeah. I have properties which keep me here. Yeah. People pay the rent. 
I get to stay. They don't pay the rent. I go home and kill them and get new renters. <laughs> no. Good, wise man, wise man. And because uh, you're long term, I'd like to know, like, how's life? Is it? Have you enjoyed living here for so long? Retired. Obviously, it has ups and downs, but in general, the future's so bright. I gotta wear shades. I mean, <laughs> life is good here. I yeah. mean, people ask me, do I get bored here? I said, well, sure. Uh, but I can't think of any better place in the world to be bored. Exactly, yeah. Seriously. Hey. I love being bored here. Mm. It's a beautiful place and some people have asked me that as well, messaging me. I'm thinking to retire there, will I get bored? I'm like, yeah, probably will. No more, right? But hey, boredom, that's part of life. Uh, what bit of advice, because you've done it a lot longer than the rest of us, what bit of advice would you give someone else thinking to do it? I think the advice you've already gave that I remember in your first videos was just do it. Yeah. I mean, yeah, get your P's and Q's and everything in, a, in an order. Start planning as fast as you can. Put it together. Come visit. Don't just move. Mm. Come visit. Make sure it's for you. Yeah. Because there's a lot of nice countries. But I would say it's probably for you. <laughs> mm. <laughs> but don't bring too many people. We don't want to get overcrowded here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and only positive people, yeah? Yes, for sure. <laughs> uh, well, All the good people. I was going to ask someone else. Oh, yeah, you want to say hello to anyone back in the States? <laughs> well, I burned all my bridges. So. <laughs> all right. Just anybody who knows me, for sure, <laughs> yeah. hello. You know, anybody that watches this channel and have more people watch it, too, please. Yeah. Hit that share, like, all that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even know how to do that. All right, darling. <laughs> Thanks a lot, mate. Hey, a lot of coming from someone else that might have another one. Yep. Another retiree. Hi, people. <laughs> Cheers, Ollie, thank you. Dean, just remembered, always, once you get off camera, you remember what to say. What happened? What's your channel? My channel is What's Dean Doing in Thailand? Right, okay. It's linked in the description. Thank you. Maybell is patiently still trying to get Justin Bieber tickets. Yeah, not easy. <laughs> no, no tickets yet. What a shame. <laughs> Sorry, babe, I'm joking. <laughs> I want you to go. Number one fan here, Justin Bieber, if you see us at the concert, give a shout out to Maybell. <laughs> okay, so we've done a few shout outs and another YouTuber has been coming lately, but he didn't come today. I wanted to get him on camera and give his channel a shout out. You'll probably, a few of you will already know of him. Uh, Sean from Vlogging a <laughs> I'm here with <laughs> Sean. I think a lot of you might recognize him. Sean from Vlogging a Dead Horse. Good channel, mate. And yeah, we're just gonna have a little chat and introduce, have a chat with Sean about being here in Phuket. Yes. Oh. Wait, let's just ask, where are you from? Norwich. Norwich. I was born in Norwich, yes. Norwich, how long have yes. you been in Thailand? Coming up to six months. Six months? Yes. And uh, how are you getting on? How are you finding it? Um, I'm now... You've been before? Yeah, yeah, I've, I've been coming to Thailand for holidays. In 2006 was the first year I come. Yeah. and sort of went all over and then coming year after year after year I'd come with a friend, we'd travel, oh, yeah. we'd always same have... Like, same like me. Yeah, always have like three uh, or four weeks in Thailand. And uh, I think I heard you saying something to Paddy the other day about extreme backpacking. Yes. That sounds oh, well, interesting, tell us about that. Well, well, the, that was the nightmare. Huh? Uh, what with the nightmare with Paddy Doyle. Oh, I, you, I tell... I just, uh, uh, no, you said... Um, was it you? You said extreme backpacking, you get somewhere and then spend all your money no. Was that not you? Oh, no. That was somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean well, a lot of people in the garden, you see. <laughs> yeah, you've got no money and then you, you, yeah, you've you, got to make yeah, your you way. Yeah, you've got no with... money, you've got to make your way. Oh, sod that. Yeah, no, 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 proper vlogging you know you're yeah it's, pick the camera up and go and just go and express yeah. what you that, that's good it's a good way you know like a uh, harold boulder harold boulder yes. and bold and bankrupt that's like two guys i was watching yeah i so, i what is it when i look at youtube there's lots of different business models to where you can carry on your youtube channel with yeah, vlogging yeah. you know you can edit as much as you want yeah, you can put all your drone footage you can have your slow motions you you, you can yeah, go yeah. as the, the, the more you put into all that, then the more time you spend in the apartment, yeah, right? Well, that's why um, I'm starting using the phone because I was using a, a Sony camera, editing on the MacBook, yes. and it was taking so much time. And I was thinking, I me, mean, this is like just transferring stuff hard, all the time. And hard edit. work. It is hard work. Since I switched to the mobile phone, yes, the iPhone 12, much yes. better. Yes, and the more you edit, 
in my opinion. The I've, more work. It, well, the more work it is, and then you, you have to. I mean, I'm now doing some drone films, and the reason why they're so slow is because of the amount of editing. They, they yeah. have to trans. That's why I don't use the drone that much. It's like it's it's another up. job. Yes. And it's like the weather is red hot. It doesn't or like Or it's it. fucking windy, or you know whatever. Yeah, so you're going about vlogging, um, what, what visa are you on, if you don't mind me asking? No, I'm on a 60 day COVID. 60 um, day COVID extension? Um, yes. Right, yeah. And I'm hoping, after speaking with um, uh, your friend who rent the boat, right, Steve. Yeah. Steve. Steve. Steve, yeah, he's a top guy. Yeah, well, uh, today I'm off to Phuket to the immigration to see if I can get out again. Because um, I run out in you know, just over two weeks' time. Right. And I ain't ready to go anywhere yet. Um, no, you want to stay? I've got plenty. I've got my, my work is not done here. That's the other no. question I wanted to ask. Phuket, how are you finding Phuket? Like really, really enjoying it, and surprisingly so. Yeah. Because yeah, it's got a bad rep. Well, the only thing bad about it, and I, I did as I come here today, there's a police checkpoint set up in, yeah, in Patong. They keep moving it around, yeah, but um, I was. They didn't pull me over. I was really chuffed because I've been pinched three. So I've had three instances with the police since I've been here. Yeah. Two with fines, one without. Oh, but they're pulling people over all the time. It's ridiculous. But I saw a report on, on Twitter the other day that uh, the police at Phuket have been changed. They've transferred yeah, yeah, yeah. some of them because, uh, the, because yeah, of a, uh, a bad reputation. A club, uh, uh, a hotel resort was staying open when it wasn't meant to. Okay. That's been going on for two years. And then they just decided to close it, close it down now. Okay. I'm not sure to close it down, but clamp down on it and move some coppers to a different place. Oh, that would have, yeah, they'd, they'd have done that, okay. Yeah, so, yes. how long you had the channel? Vlogging a dead horse, how long you had it? Just six months. Six months? Yes, yeah, so you're then. doing good, you're doing better than me. It's all oh, it's been two years. <laughs> oh, but I do it every day. Yeah, you're doing it daily. And I, I, where I now went to Payam a few weeks ago and I had no internet and I didn't put anything up, well, my channel fell off a cliff. Really? I, yeah, yeah, my views went up now. You need to pump it. But that's what I'm now doing now. I, and and because of that, I now have to post every day. Yeah. I, I, you know, I cannot... And that's uh, that's uh, not uh, sustainable, is it? Well, I've, I've... You can do it for now, but obviously a year in, are you going to be able to well, keep we, doing I, it daily? You have, to, you have to take a break. Yeah, well, I... I... I well, I don't know. This, yeah, you don't you, know I don't know. I'll, yeah. ju I'll, just, I'll just wing it uh, and say, see you know, how we go. I've been doing it. Well, I've been doing it two years, and yeah, after probably you'll get to a year, the yearly point, and then uh, yes. I need a break, or you can't post videos every day for for a year. Well, I I, it's quite. You might do. I don't know. I, well, I went out yesterday uh, to make a vlog. I went to the airport to make another vlog at the airport, but because the wind has changed, the the, the planes aren't coming in over the sea right. to land, they're coming in over the, the motorway. Way, so there's the, there's no film to be made there because um, I want to get the footage where all the people on the beach, they all jump up. You can yeah, need yeah. the camera angle yeah, low. So the, the, the planes come yeah. in really. Yeah, it's really right. good. And the afterburner as well. I want to I want to get more oh, footage yeah, that, of, of that, yeah. especially if there's bigger planes. So I went to do that yesterday, but the wind's come in the wrong direction. so. There was no vlog to be made. <laughs> I actually right. did when I was at Kanchana Biri. You know, I got a full frame film camera to oh, do yeah. proper yeah, films. Go pro, turn. No, no, I've got a proper big SLR super duper yeah, filmmaking camera. Which one do you use the most? I use the the only one I use for vlogging is the GoPro. GoPro it's so turn. easy, and it's it's like this because yeah. it's not like you're actually speaking to a proper uh, camera. camera. Yeah, it's yeah. not like oh, you forget oh, it's oh, there. Oh, you almost. forget it's there. Yeah, and, yeah. And, and that's that, good. That's how it works, but when it I put more on, natural then it, it is exactly. As soon yeah. as I put on that big camera, I I I can't find my words. Yeah, yeah. I forget. Or you, the brain doesn't going, like right, it. I'm going to say this, and then it fucking leaves it just your head. Come and you're out. Like, Shit, it, it, I meant it to say that. Yeah, yeah. The phone's a bit better than a big camera, and I think everyone's switching to like phones or GoPro. You know, it's just easier. Isn't it, it is easy. Well, the stability. Yeah. Uh, you, uh, the GoPro 10. Uh, as far as vlogging go. It's, it's a cinch, it's easy. Yeah. You just put it there, it's got a real wide view. And, and what did you what did you 
actually say what you used to do back at home? What you know? Before, yeah. Wheeling and dealing. Wheeling buying, and dealing. buying and selling. You've never been like a proper nine to five kind of guy. You. I have. Yeah. I've, I've worked in an office. Really? Oh, yeah. Right. That's what you was just like. Yeah. You see, you're, you're a good character. You know what I mean? I like yeah. character. <laughs> I haven't done get nine to five. Yeah. No, I've last seven years. I've had eBay account. Right. And buying and selling, wheeling and dealing, and all the. All the st whenever I've bought stuff and sold it, yeah. I've always sold the rubbish or always the stuff slightly damaged, a bit scratched. I've sold all that uh, so I could keep all the good stuff. Right. That was all mint. Yeah, yeah. And then when lockdown came, yeah. all that mint stuff right. was so. Oh, they, if it was worth fifty quid on eBay, it was now worth one hundred and fifty right. or three fifty. Yeah, it yeah. went ballistic. So. Yeah. And you sell it? And, and I sold sold <laughs> sold ninety percent of what I owned. Right, and I've, I've and started travelling. It, yeah, and it's, it's I was I changed that life for this life. It was the opportunity right. that come along, yeah. where I all of a sudden, if I sell all this, I've got this lump of money. That lump of money should do me to build up an audience and become successful in earning from your, yeah, yeah. YouTube. That's you it, know, yeah, I think. Uh, if you keep doing YouTube, you know you're you're growing. I think you're growing pretty well because six months, you know, six months I had nothing. Like, in you, you, got, you, you could, started off yes. on, on your. I don't think you're going to change the way you're doing it. I started off all fucking wrong and changed everything. You right. started off the style As, you want to do it, and yes. you, you just continue doing that. And yeah, one of them will pop up. One's popped up a little yes. bit already. Well, the next one, <laughs> I'm now going to make another one because Steve, when Stephen was, it's, I've got a buyer for the horse. Uh, we've just got a, we've just got a, for the, the horse, the, right, the scooter yeah. when I leave, yeah, yeah with Stephen. Yeah. The, right. oh, he, yeah, rent, yeah, he rents yeah. mopeds, yeah. it's just a matter of uh, getting the figure correct, you oh, know. Yeah. But he did yeah. point out how dirty the horse was, so right, I yeah. need to... <laughs> yeah, but it's quite easy to clean up, new panels and stuff like that. But no, I need, to, I need to hire four dirty women to clean it. That 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 that, 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 that might make a good video yeah, and yeah. Um, get, give me a reputation for yeah. dirty birds. A bit like CB Media style, get some hot chicks that, in the that's, video. That's exactly <laughs> uh, And think, a motorbike. Uh, that's exactly it. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. So uh, how long? Uh, how much longer are you staying in Thailand? And well, I don't know. I wonder if I can get my visa extended for right. another sixty days. Yeah. Then I'll probably stay around here. Uh, I want to go to Krabi and this part of the area. Uh, as much, and even back to Kolak. Uh, in this, because it's the first Koh time, Lak. all the times I've been to Thailand, I've never been yeah. south. Koh Sok is nice as yes, well. Yes, Koh, Koh Sok. National Park. And then, the oh, you've got Koh Lanta. Koh Lanta, yeah. In their Malaysia border. Yeah. You, you know, um, they're not places where... Krabi. You've been to Krabi? Not yet, no, no, none of Krabi. these places. You can so. drive there from here as well. Yeah, I'd, uh, where I've got my apartment at such a good rate, I don't want to give it up. No, it's a rub. 500 baht. 500 baht a night. <laughs> yeah, right, and yeah, it's a flat. Yeah, that's alright. You know, uh, yeah, it's really good. It yeah. is really good. And it's quiet as well. And so that to me is a bit of a luxury. So rather than going to Krabby and finding somewhere else, I can just drive there on the scooter each day and do what I want to do. Yeah. Um, you know. Well, I think that's it, mate. This is just a bit of an off the cuff interview. Yeah. So. I was asking other people, like you know, they're, they're retired here and staying here long term. But you're you're here just doing your YouTube, aren't you? That's your yes, yeah. You're not planning on staying staying long term. No, you've I've got, got to get other places. You've I've got, got thing, things to do, I've places got, to go. I've got mass. I've got the world to see. Yeah, as they yeah. Say. I think yeah. That's, that's you're gonna you're gonna carry on what your blogging. It? Yeah, yeah. What is other it? places? Yeah, well, uh, oh. let me think, man. Without coining a phrase, what is it? <laughs> the channel is only just getting started. Right, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're, we're, we're just, only just getting started. Yeah, Thailand's the first one and many more places to visit after. Yes, many, yeah. many. And uh, I want to say yeah. thank you for sharing Cheers. the video here and saying the best breakfast in Thailand. It is definitely <laughs> a good breakfast. It is. Yeah, and you, you show people directions yeah. to it as well, yeah. Yes, Thanks on the that, sign mate. off the main yeah. road. Uh, which people, they're, they're a lot all, of people get lost. They're all cleaning that up today. Yeah. Have you seen that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're they doing do all that the here. Sides. They go around all the hills chopping up, you know, they have to yeah, keep it Yeah, I know, it like, keeping it down. It turn um, into a jungle like it should be. <laughs> that's really good. Yeah. Really good. Right, cool. mate, thanks a lot. No, thanks cheers, cheers. cheers. And I'm going to have thanks the. Mate. I'm going for We're the going big, for a bigger yeah, breakfast, big today. breakfast today. Yeah, I am. I'm hungry. Yeah.